Hello, hello. Welcome to the 2021 Cast Stembridge Summer Camp. Our team has spent six weeks at the UTD lab focused on this project, and we hope our end result won't disappoint. So first things first, let's meet our team. Uh, this summer camp project uh, is about building a benchmark data set of the human hand interaction with the objects. Uh, it is important for our future work to investigate new AI algorithms to teach robots how to manipulate these objects, as well as new augmented reality algorithms to instruct novice users wearing the AR glasses on how to manipulate those objects. Uh, and part of the technical components in uh, building this data set is to be able to automatically detect the human hands from the capture videos uh, from multiple Intel rear sense cameras and to reconstruct in 3D the hands shape and pose in those videos. So the first thing that we did was gather data and manually annotate it with detection labels. After training four faster RCNN ResNet 101 based models with different configurations, we were able to accurately detect both hands and objects as well as predict hand side, contact state, and offset vector. There was still some time left, so we decided to add 3D. The basic premise was to concurrently run mesh reconstruction on all hands detected within a frame across multiple models and GPUs. Thus using a ResNet 18 hand encoder and mano differentiable rendering layer, we were finally able to achieve the combined pipeline consisting of outer hand detection analogous to a focusing system and inner concurrent hand mesh reconstruction for any frame and video. Further applications include, but are not limited to, AR, VR, and robotics. Uh, these are all non-trivial tasks. I'm happy to see our group students are working so hard on the problem, although some of them uh, techniques like a deep learning uh, are totally new to most of them. And I'm very impressed to see that within just six weeks, they learn from scratch those hand detection and the 3D reconstruction algorithms and be able to finish the deep learning implementation of those algorithms, reconstruct the 3D hands from those capture videos and conduct some basic analysis on the results. And this is phenomenal achievement for all of them. <laughs> 